let's read the last line first what will be the probable diagnosis so the question here is patient comes to the dentist complains of severe sensitivity on examination erosion of the lingual side in upper anterior teeth and generalized attrition was evident so we have to diagnose the condition so uh, here if you just see the there is severe sensitivity and there is erosion of the lingual side in upper anterior teeth right so if we see these two things so we will be able to understand yes this is going to be the erosion because erosion is generally seen on the lingual aspect of anterior maxillary teeth right maxillary anterior teeth at the same time yes since erosion is there there will be decrease in enamel there will be hypersensitivity that is the dentinal hypersensitivity because there will be the opening of the dentinal tubules right so there will be dentinal hypersensitivity and that's why the patient would be showing the severe sensitivity here now if we just see the different options here one is the gastric esophageal regurgitation disease in this what happens some of the amount of the uh, food comes out or comes back through the esophagus into the oral cavity right so that is called as the GERD. Then we have a condition called bulimia nervosa. Now that is a very interesting uh, condition and it is generally seen in females. What happens to avoid the weight gain, the uh, females uh, or even the patient generally try to do the binge eating. That means uh, whatever they eat, they try to vomit that out to uh, avoid gaining the weight right so there will be an artificial vomiting or the voluntary vom vomiting by the patient okay to avoid the weight gain and that is called as the binge eating as well right then we have the third condition that is known as the typhoid in the typhoid yes there is problem in the abdominal muscles right so yes it is an infectious disease and it doesn't have to do anything with the uh, erosion of the lingual side then we have another syndrome that is known as the zollinger ellison syndrome and it is a condition in which a gastrin secreting tumor gastrin secreting tumor or we can say the hyperplasia or hypertrophy in islet cells of the pancreas and that all cause the overproduction of the gastric acid and this particular gastric acid when it is overproduced it causes the peptic ulcers so there will be ulcers in the mucosa of the stomach right and that is known as the peptic ulcers right so these are the various conditions now we know that uh, the erosion of the teeth erosion generally occurs due to the GERD G E R D because there is reflux of the acid into the oral cavity and that acid comes into the direct contact of the upper anterior teeth and where that causes the demineralization since demineralization occurs there there will be loss of the enamel and that will cause the dentinal hypersensitivity as well so the diagnosis here is going to be your first option that is GERD where there is reflux of the food and that is generally acidic also right acidic food into the oral cavity and this acid generally uh, decreases the pH of the oral cavity and that comes in direct contact of the upper anterior teeth and that uh, causes the erosion of the lingual aspect of these teeth. So the answer is going to be your first option that is GERD GERD. So we will quickly walk through the explanation here. The gastroesophageal reflux disease it is generally uh, associated with heartburn because yes there will be a regurgitation of the acidic food although sometimes the food is not acidic then also when it comes out or if it uh, the reflux is seen there then also there will be similar feeling of having the heartburn as well okay so yes the food can be non-acidic fluid or it can be acidic fluid and both will be producing the same symptoms only 10 percent of the patients with heartburn exhibit no increase in acidic or non acid esophageal reflux so that is something which we have to just understand okay 
So yes, recurrent acid regurgitation if it occurs, there will be direct contact with the upper teeth and that causes the poor dentition or basically the erosion of the lingual aspect of the dentition. So yes, the answer to this question is going to be your GERD, that is your first option.